This is our midpoint proof. To prove the midpoint between two points, we must first have two points, point one and point two. Point one will be denoted as x1, y1, and x2, y2 for the second point. We then want to represent the line connecting the two points because we're trying to find the midpoint between the two lines, any two lines in general. To find the midpoint, we must first do a comparison between the x and the y axes. First on the x axis, the x1 and x2 point on the x axis need to be denoted. And the values on the y-axis need also be denoted. They're corresponding parts for each one. The y1 value and the y2 value. Average is defined as adding the values and dividing by how many values there are. Since there are two values for each of these, we will add the two values and divide by two. Starting with the y-axis, we add each y-component and divide by two. y1 plus y2 divided by two. And then the x-values. The average of the x-values is x1 plus x2 divided by two. We then want to represent these average values corresponding to the point on the, on the line between the two points. The average of the x's and the average of the y's correspond to the average between the two points, or otherwise known as midpoint. The midpoint is defined as x1 plus y1, x1 plus x2 over 2, comma, y2 plus y1 over 2. And that is our midpoint proof.